Hello, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Man the Maker, <clears throat> and welcome to another episode of Caveman to Cosmos. We're going to figure out how to scrape some stuff. We're also, you know, kind of putting our focus into some lumber gathering, so that's cool. I like that. Uh, you can... Did I make a chaser? Stone thrower. Chaser. That's who we want here. Uh, go uh, do me some hunting there. Uh, let's go back to the north, you know. I think I want to go back to the north. Get revenge on that damn wolverine that killed me. I do have to remember, I gotta be a little bit more careful, right? They, they don't start that strong. Last time I kind of just threw the guy away. Um, let's not do that. Our first fight to, to kill us, please. Yeah, just heal. Get me some lumber gathering. Oh, that's nice. We got a little bonus from that. All right, Chaser. Into the frozen north. Korgoth of Barbaria. And the wizard Speculees. <laughs> Some short-lived adult swim show. Uh, called. I think it was called Korgoth of Barbaria. I don't know. It was pretty dumb. I think maybe they even only made a pilot for it. And I have no idea if you can watch that anywhere. Um... More eagles. It's actually an eagle eagle. Not a bald eagle, but an eagle eagle. I know I said, hey, you know, be kind of chill. But uh, forget that. Folklore eagle, yeah. Nice. A little bit more science. Everybody's burning their garbage. How do I burn garbage? You're all the way at the bottom, if I recall. Fire making. Do I not? have fire making tech was that not in like the super beginning controlled fire cooking drying flint napping heat treatment that can't be it can't be this far what am i missing where where is fire making already have it I don't understand fire making okay wow some people have fire making good lord I mean maybe they're like gunning towards stuff that's um slightly intimidating nice we did get uh, okay but we don't have access to the next level of hunter but we can go with woodsman I'll heal you we got another subdued eagle. Go on home. Um, you are just a scout. That's fine. Enemy spotted near Washington, D.C. Okay, it's just a freaking pigeon. Um, yeah, you know, keep getting experience, I guess. Housing lean twos? Ah, because we've got the wood. Lean twos, huh? It's just... Um, it replaced something. It must have replaced something. Well, now we have wood. Now we can use wood for things. So that's probably useful. Alright. Wolverines. Once again. Uh, send all these guys home. It's not a very good uh, chance. They, they are pretty scary. Um, gatherer. Build a road out to there, please. And you... Folklore of the Sky? Cancel last mission? That's kind of weird. You do get to fly pretty quickly. Um, game hunters, Neanderthal slingers, foxes, yeah, yeah, yeah. I 
I gotta get away from these wolverines, okay? Let's just come back down over here. Grass gather is almost done. <coughs> So did you make a, a folklore? I, I don't really understand what you did there, buddy. An animal snare traps. It's a bit slower. Um, wood spearmen. Good lord. I just got up to three and they're already at four. So my military buildup... Maybe not that uh, useful. Scraping. Traditional populations in Ethiopia, Alaska, and Canada today show that it can take eight hours to scrape a single hide. That is pretty intense. Just like scraping the fleshy bits off of the skin. Wow. But hey, free science, workers build faster, and then bark working. Um, this Neanderthal spearman is hunting me down. Um, you are building me a road to here. Please continue. Waking up because of the fox. I will go after you. Sure. And success. Little bit of food. Um, we can probably segue that directly into the loon. Because they're just so actually pathetic. Brown bear, not so much. Not so pathetic. Um, I will go here. Is this caves? Yeah. We'll 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 heal up on uh, the hillside. Seven turns, sure. Let's do it. And our boy has healed up. We can go and smack down a bald eagle. Why not? All right, just farming some experience, basically. Doesn't make much of a difference. Almost got that animal snare trap. An okapi. Heal up, and then let's try and, I mean, it's pretty strong. Animal snare traps are done. Do we have any wonders available? Captured fire. One national wonder left. Yeah, pass. Um, we can go for all of this food stuff. We can spawn a barbarian exile. Don't really want to do that. Just like kind of snagging all of this cheap stuff. Kind of want the dance hut, actually. Uh, no. And then I think... We'll pick up, like, all this cheap food. And then we'll see from there. Folklore of the Unicorn? Childbirth hut? Basket? Yeah, okay. I'll get some baskets. I think you can use them for other stuff. Hunting instructions is pretty cool. All right, we'll start off there. I think the Okapi is just gonna be too strong for you. Generally speaking. I'm not even sure that the chaser is really worth it at this point. Did I say do dance at first? I guess so. Um, yeah, woodsman. And heal. I know you're not in the woods, but that's okay. I guess I must have said do the dance hut on top. Fine. I mean, we do have a storyteller ready to plop down some dancing. Um, okay. We'll give the culture and the science. Subdued Wolverine over here. So they've managed to do it. Once we get the, the forest attack, 
up, then we can really kind of start dealing with this bigger stuff, I think. But until then, not a chance. Bark working is coming our way as well, pretty soon. Also the dance hut. The oldest known sandals and the oldest known footwear of any type were discovered in Fort Rock Cave in the U.S. state of Oregon. Radiocarbon dating of the sagebrush bark from which they were woven indicates an age of at least 10,000 years. And they're surprisingly stylish. I think they're making a comeback in this modern age. So, okay, cool. We can do bark gatherers, but also housing bark huts. Just free uh, plus three production once we get the bark, right? Requires bark, indeed, which we will be able to do. I mean, once the dance hunt is done, I'm definitely going for the bark thing. Let's see now. Some, like, more advanced stuff over here. Microlith workshop, flint napping, bone working, some bone huts. Feather worker, feathers and whatnot. That's a lot of production over there. I kind of like the adhesives. Uh, sewing... Doesn't really provide much kind of like on its own. Animal hide tents. Carving for those excrement holes. Poison crafting, I mean... Aim for tracking again? I was aiming for trapping before. Now I'm aiming for tracking. I think that's going to be wonderful. Drying. Drying frame is pretty good. Dried meat maker provides dry meat. Okay. I'm happy to kind of like look ahead a little bit. Uh, you need to heal, buddy. All right. And I think that's all that we got going on. And the dance hut is done. So, building tab. I don't remember what <laughs> I wanted to build. Bark. No. Yes. Bark gather. It's not that quick, but uh, I think it's definitely going to be worth it. Um, meanwhile, so the gatherer finished over here. I'm actually going to have them chill. Uh don't really need to improve anything might as well kind of have them in the bank uh for the eventuality where we do want to do something with them unit reward dance fox okay we can make dance halls faster that's uh nice get a little bit of culture a little bit of great person situation also we can now do some other dances blood dances Let's war on happiness. Eventually, that's probably pretty uh, useful. And never goes obsolete. Oh, really? Um, fertility dance. A little bit of extra food. Moon dance. Some espionage. We're not actually gaining any espionage. A little bit of money. 1% food. The war dance. Um, I'm pretty happy to go for the war dance, I think. I know we're not building military units now, but when we do, hey, whatever, 5%. Interesting to see that some wolves have actually showed up over here. So, I don't know, maybe we should get our hunter back. I'm kind of surrounded right now by a bunch of bears, which is, you know, pretty scary. But uh, nothing we can do about them. The wolves, on the other hand. Hmm. The ground was stone, but I ground it, and it not stone no more. That's how it works, baby. All right. We have revealed some flour and grains. We actually need to make them. A quern provides flour. If we have... Not sure exactly how this works. Ah, gatherers. I don't know if we have any of this stuff. So probably we're not going to be able to build them. Right? Is there a way to like turn on... resources oh uh, yeah well, that's nice some indigo up there and some camels horses a bunch of poultry we got the marble okay yeah unfortunately we don't have any access to grain right now so what are you gonna do in a very nice move this wolf has decided to just stay and hang around here for us to come and bash it over the head with the rock 
Hopefully we subdue. We did not subdue. That is pretty unfortunate. But did we level up? No. No level up either. So we finished our Bark Gatherer. And I'm kind of expecting to see... Uh, you've built a Bark House? Grass Huts being upgraded into... Uh, we don't have the resource yet. Maybe next turn? Takes a, a turn for it to tick in. Bark Huts built. Indeed. And just, just like that... A little bit of unhealth, yeah, sure, but three production and one money, just like that. Actually building the Bark Gatherer gave us four production, which is pretty incredible. Let's go look for that other uh, wolf that we saw out here. Um, okay, they have decided to kind of move in here. Go and beat him over the head. Our Neanderthal spiked club. Basically, he's got an axe. Did I actually capture the caribou? I did. Well, that's nice. And uh, here is a viper, another animal that we never captured. Have a pretty strong chance of being successful here. And we have, but we did not subdue them, unfortunately. Um, getting closer to leveling, of course. Yes, you did a great job there, buddy. Uh, getting me a caribou is pretty awesome. I think with this kind of animal, you can do some different things even. Like constructing a herd of deer. Yeah, that's, that's much better. Plus one food, plus one hammers. Also provides a deer, which I think we can then use uh, to segue... Into meat somehow? I, I'm not entirely sure about that. Nah, uh, you just go back to sleep. The spike clubmen are pretty scary. We're not we're not gonna go mess with them. But it's nice to know that we actually have some territorial integrity over here. I feel pretty good about that. Just a pheasant up there. Not gonna chase it, though we will approach it. Given the opportunity. Of course, it runs away. Um, yeah, and we are, I mean, 378 turns. But, hey, you know, just by getting these small snippets of food. I mean, what turn are we on? Is it turn 613? It might be. <laughs> okay, no animals up here. I don't know if we can take on a wolverine if we encounter one yet. A red fox, for sure. And again, what we're looking for is to level up once more and actually get the forced attack. Fortunately, they withdrew. Do you get experience from that? I can't tell. Maybe maybe a small, small amount. Yeah, just finish them off, please. I wonder... Can you... Skip the, uh, <laughs> the animations here? Game. Uh, quick combat. There we go. Okay, we don't actually need to see these long drawn out combats. Hey, natural pigments. Masterpieces were once only pigments on a palette. That's probably true. Um, okay, we can make uh, some things. But I guess it's going to be quite limited by what's available to us. Indigo is nearby. Um, I don't think we're near any sand or anything. We don't have stone and we don't have fresh water. We do have fresh water, so we can get clay at least. What are these guys just sitting here for? What, what are they doing? I do wonder. Wealthiest doesn't really mean anything at this point. Yeah, we're just continuing to kind of like eke out a little bit of food, right? 
just kind of don't want to fall too far behind because if the AI grows in population and we don't, uh, that can be a pretty big problem. Put my collars over there, huh? Spike Clubman is moving out. Oh crap, a slinger? Uh, we should be okay here in the forest. Yeah, they decided to just leave. Not a whole lot of animals up here though, I was, I was hoping for more. They are moving out with some amount of force. Are they gonna do anything of note? Entering into my territory. Shall we go and meet them? Say, hey, get the hell out of here. You want to attack me over the reaver? I encourage this. I want to keep them a hell away from this thing. That's, that's really what I want to do. Even if that leaves me actually exposed? Hmm. Maybe I can uh, keep them away from it. I'll be annoyed if they do move on to it. Kill a pheasant. Make me feel better. Thank you. <laughs> Kill a red fox. Make me feel better. Thank you. Yeah. That's right. I don't know where they're going. This horse will murder me, apparently. <laughs> Yeah, y'all just stay right there. Be gone. Be gone. <clears throat> nice, we got the level up. Woodsman 3, we love it. With that, maybe we can... Can you go away? I sure wish I could attack them, but... Leave my territory. I've got an 83% chance against the horse. Oh my goodness. Uh, let's kill this thing. That's new. I'm going to kind of just keep hounding them away. Because they're also doing some hunting. Somebody finally got folklore. Um, I'm pretty content. They, they seem to have actually left me alone, so that's nice. Uh, you can murder the viper? Great. Yeah, being able to attack in the woods like that, very, very strong. We'll heal up over here. And uh, just send y'all home. Alright, our, uh, what is this? Usuri Dola? I don't know what that is. Some kind of dog, I think. Yeah, we'll do that. I also... I removed some of these. We, we had a couple more uh, food buildings. And I said, you know what? I'm actually <clears throat> not that interested in them. Give me the basket maker and then we can kind of take another look at what's going on here. Um, I'm going to risk this. Let's try and take out a horse. <sighs> Shit. That is too bad. The venom clamors of a jealous woman. Poison more deadly. Indeed. So we got, if we were Carib, Culture Carib, North American. So if we had Coast and Mushrooms, we would actually be able to pick up this culture. You have to build it, and then we would have access to the Carib Blowgunner. Starts with Poison Tips. Um, we do not start with that. But we will almost certainly make ourselves a Poison Crafter. Free poison tips uh, for hunters. and uh, like This could give us a leg up on those horses in the future, for example. Um, but I think we are going to end this episode here. My throat is also getting a little bit sore after talking so much. And I am still a little bit sick. So uh, I'm going to also end the evening of recording there. Not that that makes any damn difference to you. Um, but, I mean, we've made a lot of progress, right? Uh, of course, we're still pretty small. This is just how the game starts, right? You can't build cities. You, you just don't expand that much. 
Um, you kind of just do this slow, steady build up, but that's the game, baby. That, and that's like, you know, that's what I love about it. We're getting for tracking. What we're gonna build the poison tip, have poison tips. We're gonna get the next level hunter, and then we're gonna definitely be able to take on horses and other larger animals, um, which I'm really excited for. I think if you capture a horse, you can ride horses. You, you can build uh, units that ride horses. You don't necessarily need them, though. We do have that here, so. Okay, maybe that's not such a big concern for us. But anyways, that's it for this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And until next time, my name is Man the Maker. Take care, everybody. Have a wonderful day.